This is Quiplash. I'm Schmitty, and you're an acceptable group of players. All right, feeling good, you guys? Well, we'll see if we can fix that. Let's go. Remember, anyone who wants to join the audience can do so at any time by logging in with the room code. Time for round one. You'll get two prompts on your device. Just answer them however you want. Your responses, or quips, will be pitted against someone else's, and everyone will vote on their favorite. You score based on the percentage of players who like your answer. Plus, there are winner's bonuses at stake. Go! Take a look. First up, an inappropriate thing for a detective to say at a crime scene. Okay, everyone, vote for your favorite. Okay, next one. A realistic, honest fast food slogan. It's voting time. Next in line, what tattoo should Justin Bieber get next? Time to vote. Coming up next, Jesus' real last words. Vote on your devices. And next, the best shirt to wear next to somebody who's wearing an I'm with stupid t-shirt. It's voting time.
And next is... The worst thing a plastic surgeon could say after he botched your surgery, I'm sorry, I accidentally blank. Time to vote. Next one, after the Heimlich Maneuver, the second best way to stop someone from choking. Vote on your devices. Next up, the difference between grade A beef and grade B beef. It's voting time. That's all for round one. Here's the scoreboard. <laughs> round two is straight ahead, and that means all points are doubled. Okay, it's time for some quip lashing. First one, a name for a really bad Broadway musical. Okay, voting time. Pick your favorite. Something squirrels probably do when no one is looking. Vote on your devices.
Next in line, the worst name for a racehorse. Time to vote. Passengers never want to hear a pilot say. Coming up next, on your wedding night, it would be horrible to find out that the person you married is blank. Vote on your devices. one you wouldn't want to share a prison cell with someone named blank it's voting time Next one, the worst thing to find frozen in an ice cube. And next is, come up with a three word sequel to the book Eat, Pray, Love. Time to vote. That's all for round two. Fire up the scoreboard. <laughs> and now, round three, the last lash. Point values are tripled, and you'll all be answering the same prompt this time. Your last lash prompt is... Pick any city name and make it sound dirty. Everybody's in. Okay, in round three, you get to award three votes. You can give them all to one answer or spread them out.
That's the end. Let's see the final scoreboard. That's spelled S C H MIDI. Okay, let's have a good clean fight. No quips below the belt. This is round one. You'll score points based on the percentage of people who prefer your answer. Have at it. Okay, here we go. Starting things off, the worst thing to receive for trick or treat. Okay, pick your favorite. Next one, what dogs think when they see people naked? Vote on your devices.
next in line, the worst thing for an evil witch to turn you into. Time to vote. The most common thing you'd hear if you could read people's thoughts. It's voting time. Next up. What happens to circumcision skin? Vote on your devices. Coming up next, a good name for a sex robot. Time to vote. Okay, next one. The best use for a leftover meatball. It's voting time. Round one is in the books. Let's see the scores. <laughs> it's time for round two, where all point values are doubled. That's right, doubled. Start this show. Our first prompt is a punchline for a joke that would make children cry. Okay, voting time. Pick your favorite. Next, an ill-advised outfit to wear to your first day at a new job. Vote on your devices. Next 
is a terrible name for a clown. Time to vote. Next in line, what's lurking under your bed when you sleep? It's voting time. Next one, the most popular t-shirt slogan in Mississippi, probably. Vote on your devices. Next up, a better name for the Washington Monument. Time to vote. Next one, you know you're in for a bad taxi ride when blank. Vote on your devices. Round two is no more. Let's see the damage. <laughs> Welcome to the last lash, the final round. Stakes are tripled. There's just one prompt, and you're all getting it. The last lash prompt is... The worst excuse for showing up late to work. Here's the board. Give out your votes now.
That's it. Let's take a look at the final scores. Hey there, Schmitty's the name, Quiplash is the game. My, my, what an attractive group. Oh, sorry, I was talking to my framed photo of the cast of Frasier. This is round one. You get points based on the percentage of people who like your answer, and a bonus if you get more votes than your opponent. Go! Okay, here we go. The first prompt is a terrible talent to have for the Miss America pageant. Okay, everyone, vote for your favorite. Next in line, the least threatening name for a serial killer, the Boston Blank. It's voting time. Coming up next, the name of the website that probably gave your computer a virus. Time to vote. And next, something a weatherman might yell if he completely snapped during the weather forecast. OK, 
Okay, next one. A business or service that shouldn't have a drive through window. Load on your devices. A new reggae band made up entirely of chickens. <laughs> Next one The Real Secret to Living to Age 100. Time to vote. That's the end of round one. Let's take a look at the scores. Uh -huh. On to round two, where all points are doubled. Doubled, I say. Okay, it's time for some quiplashing. Our first prompt is, come up with a new dessert that contains the name of a U.S. state. Okay, pick your favorite. Coming up next, finish this sentence. When I'm rich, my mansion will have a room called the blank room. It's voting time. An unusual object to bludgeon someone to death with. Time to vote. Okay, next one. The best thing about living in an igloo. 
remote on your devices. Next up, a creepy thing to find scribbled onto a dollar bill. Time to vote. Next in line, a message found in a bottle floating in the sea. And next, another name for Canada. It's voting time. We've reached the end of round two. Let's see what happened. Uh -huh. This is round three, the last lash. Points are tripled and everyone gets the same one single prompt this time. Your prompt is... It's disappointing to put together a 1,000 piece puzzle and realize it's just a picture of blank. See the responses. Apply your votes. That's all. Now for the final scores.
to Quiplash. Population, you guys. Oh, I've got a good feeling about this. I'm sorry, I was talking to my tater tots again. Let's go. Time for round one. You score based on the percentage of players who like your answer. Plus, there are winner's bonuses at stake. Go. Take a look. First up, the name of a new perfume by Betty White. Okay, voting time. Pick your favorite. Smells like three and a half dead ladies. I'm only counting Betty White as a half. Okay, next one. What kittens would say if they could talk? Time to vote. Next up, the last person you'd consider inviting to your birthday party. Vote on your devices. theme for a high school prom. It's voting time. Coming up next, a Girl Scouts cookie name that got rejected because it was just too ridiculous sounding. Time to vote. one usually it's bacon lettuce and tomato but come up with a BLT you wouldn't want to eat <laughs> oh. <laughs> 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 okay
Okay, next one. The most embarrassing name for a dog. Vote on your devices. of a really bizarre diet that just never caught on. It's voting time. That's round one. Let's take a look at the scores. <laughs> Time for round two, where everything is worth two times as much as that silly round one. Okay, it's time for some quiplashing. Starting things off, another name for a sex change operation. Okay, pick your favorite. Coming up next, a great name to have on a fake ID. Time to vote. A rejected crayon color. Vote on your devices. Next in line, a bad place for your rocket ship to crash would be the planet of the blank. It's voting time. Next up, a great opening line to start a conversation with a stranger at a party. Time to vote.
Okay, next one. Which new marshmallow should Lucky Charm cereal introduce? It's voting time. Coming up next, something people used to do for fun before electricity. Vote on your devices. And next, the Katy Perry Super Bowl halftime show would have been better with blank. It's voting time. Round two is now complete. Let's see who completed it well. <laughs> this is round three, the last lash. One final chance to catch up. Point values are tripled and everyone gets the same prop this time. Our prompt is the name of a pizza place you should never order from. And here's what you did. Vote with your votes now. It's over. Let's take a look at the final scores.
Hello, I'd like to welcome almost all of you to Quiplash. <laughs> yep, yeah, yep, I think I already know who the funny one is. Well, we'll see if I'm right. <laughs> this is round one. You'll see... Points based on the percentage of people who prefer your answer. Have at it.
here. Schmitty here. You there, Schmitty here. Yes. Okay, good. Now, if I don't remember your names, please feel free to take it personally. This is round one. You get points based on the percentage of people who like your answer, and a bonus if you get more votes than your opponent. Go! This show. First one, come up with a name for a sitcom about a bunch of wacky nuns. Okay, everyone, vote for your favorite. Next in line, something that would make an awful hat. Time to vote. Next one, something you should not whisper to your grandmother. It's voting time. is a bad name for a brand of bottled water. Vote on your devices. And next, the name of a canine comedy club with puppy stand-up comedians. Time to vote. Next in line, the biggest secret the government keeps. It's voting time. Next up, the worst children's board game would be Blank Blank Hippos. Wow, 
Wow, those really are horny, horny hippos. Look at them go after those balls. That's the end of round one. Let's take a look at the scores. <laughs> round two time, and to make it interesting, I'm doubling all the point values. You heard me. Okay, here we go. Our first prompt is how Garfield, the cartoon cat, will eventually die. Okay, pick your favorite. Coming up next, a poor substitute for a necktie. Vote on your devices. Okay, next one. Why is the sky blue? Time to vote. Next one, the world's most boring video game. Vote on your devices. Okay, next one. What the boogeyman is afraid of. It's voting time. Something fun to scream when you win in a game of bingo, other than bingo. Vote on your devices. Next up, something that will get you thrown out of a Wendy's. Time to vote.
That's the end of round two. Let's take a look at the scores. This is round three, the last lash. Points are tripled and everyone gets the same one single prompt this time. Our last lash prompt is... Something you rarely see used as a car decoration. Take a look. Hand out your votes. That's it. Let's take a look at the final scores. <laughs> Welcome, Quiplash, Schmitty, host. Enough with me jabbering. Let's go. Well, that's everybody, I guess. Have fun and keep your hands where I can see them. Time for round one. You score based on the percentage of players who like your answer. Plus, there are winner's bonuses at stake. Go! Okay, it's time for some quip lashing. Starting things off, a rejected phrase for one of those Valentine heart candies. 
Okay, voting time. Pick your favorite. Next in line, something that would not work well as a dip for tortilla chips. Vote on your devices. Coming up next, no one would guess this is where the treasure is buried. It's voting time. You should never get alcohol to blank. Vote on your devices. Okay, next one. An item on every pervert's grocery list. Time to vote. Next in line, a completely untrue rumor about Alvin from Alvin and the Chipmunks. It's voting time. And next, the worst car feature that ends with Holder. Vote on your devices. That's all for round one. Here's the scoreboard. <laughs> now round two, where all points and bonuses are doubled. The drama.
start this show. The first prompt is... Come up with a great title for the next awkward teen sex movie. Okay, pick your favorite. Next up, a double rainbow doesn't have gold at the end of it. Instead, it has blank. It's voting time. Next one, name a TV drama that's about a vampire doctor. Time to vote. Coming up next, the worst breakfast pancakes shaped like blank. Vote on your devices. Next up, something you don't expect to see when you spy on your neighbors. It's voting time. Okay, next one. Name a candle scent designed specifically for Kim Kardashian. Time to vote. Next in line, little known fact, over the course of a lifetime, an average person accidentally eats 10 blank. Vote on your devices. Round two is no more. Let's see the damage. <laughs> and now round three, the last lash. Point values are tripled and you'll all be answering the same prompt this time. The prompt is... A short motto everyone should live by.
Okay, soak it in. Vote away. That's all. Now for the final scores. Mm -hmm.